Hi everyone. This is a quick uh, thank you for the sponsors. You can put your um, video on pause if you want to check if you're on the list. And if you're not and you did sponsor me, please send me a little email and I will fix it as soon as possible. Now for uh, this pour, I'm going to be using the same colors I did in the last pour, but this one's going to be real messy because I am going to pour everything on there and um, I'm, I, I just don't want to tilt that much. So I'm going to put it on there. I'm going to level it out, torch it, and that's it. So for that, I will be needing a little bit bigger uh, jug, cup, whatever you call it. So I bought some sets of these little cups, things, big ones, little ones. They cost like nothing, probably come from China, yeah. So the, um, the one I'm going for is this one, that's uh, 500 milliliters. And I'm going to put the colors in there. And if you haven't noticed yet, the video yesterday I did, it has the link uh, underneath to download some of my prints for free. That's for everyone that watches my channel. You can go there and I put three, uh, three prints on. Ones I find nice. So I thought they would look really beautiful. So you can just download them for free. Like I said, just don't sell them, please. Because that isn't cute. <laughs> okay, this is a lot of paint. <clears throat> There's no metallic in this one. Right now I'm up to, let's see, almost 200 milliliters, but we are going to fix it that it is like 200. Let's see, almost there. Oh, not, not more orange because I think the orange will make it a little muddy, <clears throat> but that's about it. Yeah. Last of this blue. And last of the turquoise. And then we have exactly 200 milliliters. Now, I'm going to just pour it. Wish me luck. See, what I'm going for is a uh, sort of a level, like that, yes, and there's going to be a lot of paint going on the table, but we can't help that. But I'm hoping that this is going to be really pretty. Wow, I like it already. I even liked it before I'm torching it, but I am going to torch it. Because you know my middle name is Torch. I'm going to start off here. And as you can see, I'm holding up my, um, my torch way high. So that when you do this, as you can see, I can just hold my hand under the torch. And it's just warming up just slightly. I'm trying to avoid this. I'm gonna keep that without the uh, without the cells. But the rest I'm gonna do, and maybe I'll keep this bit here. Just maybe a little bit on the sides, just to give it a something special. I do want that to be a little bit silly too and that one but this I'm gonna leave I'm gonna leave that and I'm gonna leave this now I have some really beautiful cells but this way you know usually I pour 
then I um, let it level a little bit, then I torch and then I spread it over the um, over the canvas. And what that does is it stretches out these cells to really big proportions, but it also um, makes them long. And sometimes I just like it like this because um, this is something different, you know, always doing the same stuff that isn't you know what this art is about so as you can see how beautiful the cells are absolutely amazing I love them really do look at that ooh look at that a really long hair ooh ooh I'll have to get that out But the cells are pretty amazing, if you ask me. They're going over the side, as you can see. Down here. Okay, now let's get that hair out of there. Okay. Because, you know, I know you love me, but I don't think you want a hair in, my, in your painting. There it goes. No, you can't even see it. I think it was um, from uh, all the resin that I tried to brush out my hair, but that doesn't work. You just have to get the scissors and cut it out. Um, oh, this is pretty. These are getting really big. I like that. That it uh, has a sort of a, a sort of a cell thing that's going into that blue that didn't sell. I like that. So I'm going to keep it like this. I'm not going to torch it anymore. And it will probably um, still take about, I don't know, about 10 minutes. And then, you know, it still works. And I'm sure if you go back and forth in your video, you'll see that this is um, still working. And this bit here, maybe, because I see that these are getting a little bit bigger. And um, overall, I really uh, like it. I uh, think the orange did well because um, I was afraid it might be too bright and the yellow I don't think I put yellow in and I'm pretty glad I didn't or it'll be too flashy but right now I'm uh, pretty uh, yeah I am uh, happy with the bar especially over the sides I really like what it did over the sides and I am going to fix a corner or two just like that just really small little dots of um, canvas peep peeking through but we have to fix that let's see the other side nope that's done this corner that's it pulling it down a little to make the uh, you have to have the, a little bit of a pattern if you fix the sides, so that's done. And uh, that's it for me for today. This was a pretty quick video. Oh, I'll show you the opals because a lot of people have been asking about my opals. Now it has uh, a shine on it, as you can see. Let's put it up close, see if you can... There you are. And it does have um, sort of that light from from within. You can see it. So I like that. And here's the big one that someone said you can bash someone over the head with it. <laughs> this one's cute too. I kind of like them. But I know that what I'm looking for is something a little milky. you got to have something uh, a little uh, milky look. And then when you look deep into it, you want to see some color and you want to see some flashy stuff. Uh, so I'll, I'll be working on that too. And the prettiest, I find this one the prettiest. It's really small, but it really looks like an opal. Because it has a lot of greens and blues and just a really small tint of, um, of pink. I still have to cut it though. Oops, there's another here. Let's not drop it in my painting. But this one is one of my favorites. There's here on here. There it goes. So this one's really cute. 
See that? Even has a fire, sort of a fire thing going on in it. See that? <laughs> I'm sorry, but I really love this. Beautiful. Okay, guys, I am ready for now, and I'm going to put this one uh, up on uh, YouTube, and I'm going to wish you all a beautiful day. This is a short video, but sometimes a short one is um, okay too, right? Don't always have to have those really long videos, so I'm going to say uh, have a beautiful day, make some beautiful art, and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.